Good morning, family. Here we go. Uh, I'll let another day on the property. Man. Welcome to the arrival. And uh, once again, we're starting to work on forms. Not only forms for the fence, but forms for the house. Or for the shed, I'm sorry. Some people call it the house. And then we have the forms that were poured yesterday that are there. And here we have <clears throat> some more forms being positioned. Everything nice and cool. Everything nice and cool. You see, you're walking in an environment. A good of environment. Place. Yes. You see? Yes, thank you. Nice All place. right, my brother. Yes. It is a good environment. Workplace environment. It's good to have that. Work gets done easier when it's pleasant and, and a good environment. You good, my brother? Good, good, good. Doing yeah, a good job. Family. Yes. Yes, I walk in. <laughs> yes, how are you? Yes, You're doing a wonderful job, guys. So, yes, so we have the forms going up, and here we have, they took the forms off, and this is what you have for the pillars. So these will set, <clears throat> set up, and actually, uh, pardon. Yes. And then, uh, on the wall they're working on the wall hopefully it will be all the way around today we'll see but this is the progression that we have the guys are working doing a wonderful job nice and windy out here feels good nice and quiet yes guys are doing a great job I'm not gonna bother them because uh, let them stay focused. Beautiful job. Ready to turn that corner. Then we'll be doing the gate here eventually. But as you can see, there's still a little bit to go on this side. And uh, I guess we'll be back at you in a little bit. Okay. Thanks, guys. Okay, guys, they got the form going. Forms up on the uh, roof all the way around. They already poured that side. Poured this side. Now it's going to get poured. So on the outside, finish it up. Got one more piece to put on there. That should be done. Then. After this, we'll go all the way around with the, uh, we'll put up the jacks, I'll say. They're gonna pull that corner, put more in there. Put up the jacks. And uh, put our board across and start the ceiling. Uh, maybe next week, I think. So I know someone was saying they like to see it finished. But it's coming, guys, it's coming. Just take it nice and slow, get the security fence up and get this done. And that's just add security. Here we're mixing the cement, actually with the stone you cement, see? yes. I mixed the cement. And the sand. Yes. And then they're gonna take it, I'll show you how they pour it down into these uh, pillars to make the pillars. It would be a lot easier if it had the mixer, you know. See? Yeah, if I had my mixer here, it would be a lot less uh, work, but that's okay. They still managing. Maybe the, yeah, the mixer machine. Maybe I'll have it. Maybe I'll have it for the house. <laughs> Get that make make it easier, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. The tools, the right tools, always makes it easier. So yes, I'll just show you that process. In case you wonder how they get it down in there, you see. And then you take off those forms, and this is what you get. 
get this right here, a pillar. But you know, you know, we had those kinds where you had the hoses where you just stick them down full of concrete. You'd have a truck come and you have a certain mixture of cement. The concrete come and they're just poured down in there. So here we go. Let me show you the process here as far as the uh, pillars are concerned when they pour them. Oh, it's okay. Yeah, buckets. Yes. Come. <laughs> and then you yeah, the concrete guy is going. Yeah. You see, I'm you concreting. See? He's concrete. Walking, you take it walking, young man. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. He pours it in, then he shakes it to make sure it settles to the bottom. Shallows it. There you go. It's a lot of work. A lot of work. Okay. There you go. I'm gonna let him go here and finish filling that up. But that's the process, guys. That's the process. And these are the irons that we used. Are eight millimeter. I mean, you can use ten millimeter if you want. But the house, I, I will be using ten millimeter for a stronger steel. And then we see they're taking the blocks here. So we're, we're gonna start maybe next week, make more blocks if uh, we need them. But as you can see, they're making progress here. So I think they're gonna do that side there, run it up, run it down here. Run that all the way down. Then hopefully they'll get this side all the way over to the end there today. So we'll be back. Here you go, guys. I just thought I'd come over and look at some of these mangoes. They look really good. Look at that one. Really starting to pop out on this tree here. It's a little one, you know. But they're going to be ready here soon. Those mangoes. It's a nice big mango tree over here. This is over on the other side of our property, actually. But I just wanted you to see what these mangoes look like. They're going to be nice. Yes. And there's our fence over there. And these guys are making a block for another uh, property. It's on our side. I think it's um, coming along good over there as well. I had a request from one of our friend, uh, DJ. You wanted to see what a 20 meters look like. This is 20 meter by 20. Where this stick stops and it goes back to that wall. And um, it's about right here, 20 meters. And I'll stand here about that square back in there. Hope you can see it. Back there. The shed is six, four by six. So, and then it comes about to right here. And then down. Um, hope you can see it. This is a 20 meter, so 20 by 20 is that. All right, and then this is the other half, the 20. So yeah, it's a nice little lot. So for those who are looking for a 20 by 20, if you want to put like a, that's a six, four, like I said, four by six house. Yeah, I guess you can work something in there bigger than that. All right, there you go. Okay guys, here we are. It's the end of the day and we are at the front see they did this whole side they got up this far and they started putting some of the rebar over there and they put one form up and there goes the house so we're going to come back around this way and we got this side see okay and we are going to go here and we need one, two, three more forms put in there. And then here goes this one. They took the forms off of there. Right? They took the forms off of there. Okay. And 
we're gonna make them look down here and we're gonna go around looks like this form had a major surgery oh no but Abdullah said he will fix that there was a stone in there or something and here we go that has to be filled in higher okay and here we go he took it all the way around so now to the shed he put the forms at the top and they are going to do the roof next week once these forms are set then they put i guess the poles underneath and put some boards and they get ready to pour the cement for the slab all right and these are the bricks we have left and i guess that might they may finish the job maybe not let they get the brick guys back in and we'll resume again on monday because here in the Gambia, Friday is half day work for everyone. And, um, but for us, I think for the last three weeks, the guys have not been working on Fridays. They've been having Fridays off, Saturdays off, and, Sun and Sundays off. You hear Kenny? He said, follow me. <laughs> so we've been having three day weekends, which is nice because we do get up every day to come here. So um, we will be back on Monday. Thank you guys for tuning in. We want everyone to have a wonderful weekend. And, and we'll probably see you over the weekend with another video, okay? All right. Talk to you soon. Thanks. Bye.